With Kevin Lynch, Tom Hanneman back on a Timberwolves fast break following Minnesota's first win in Orlando in eight years, eight years and seven months to be exact. And everybody got into the act. They did so early, a great three-point shooting night. Timberwolves big three led on this night by Zach Levine. Yeah, 37 points. Uh, he got off big time in this ball game. Hit seven three points, seven of nine from downtown. So Levine uh, just basically went off like a firecracker in the 4th of July. But also Wiggins was a part of it as well as Carl uh, Anthony Towns. But Zach Levine really stole the show, uh, proving his worth as a, as a jump shooter, getting to the basket and uh, hanging in the air, dunking a number of different times as well. So Zach Levine brought his A game. As we look at the final stats, Timberwolves 74 points in the first half, shot only over 52%. They hit 13 threes in this game. Timberwolves head coach Tom Thibodeau enjoyed the win, but knows a lot of work lies ahead. For us, we have to concentrate on our improvement. When you look back at, at the season thus far, you see that every game was winnable with the exception of the OKC game, and we fell apart in the third quarter in that game. So there's, there's a small difference between winning and losing. So you, you take a hard look at the mental mistakes, and I think the biggest thing is eliminating all the ways in which you beat yourself first. Timberwolves back home now for their next four games. Uh, Clippers Saturday night, followed by the Lakers on Sunday. And the Hornets come into town Tuesday. Charlotte off to a strong start. The Wolves have lost eight in a row at home against the Clippers. Another eight-game losing streak to snap, and they'll try to do it Saturday. Yeah, Clippers, you know, you got that inside duo of uh, DeAndre Jordan, Blake Griffin. That's always a challenge for any team in the NBA, especially for the big guys. So it's going to be a tall order for Towns and Gorgie Jang to get it done against uh, really one of the best inside duels in this league. Hope you'll join us Saturday night at 6.30 for Wolves Live, ahead of the Timberwolves battle with the Clippers.